Facebook working? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah? I think so. Hi, Facebook. Right. Is it working? Yeah. Oh, you're watching it from your phone. <laughs> wow, that's trippy. Okay. Hello. Hello, Underwater Sunshine Fest Instagram. And I think we're cross posted on Underwater Sunshine Fest Facebook too. Um. Yeah, how's it going? For those of you who don't know who we are, we are Michaela Davis and Kean McCarthy and Shane McCarthy. And um, we're going to play some songs. Saturday morning.
Alright, thanks guys and gals. <laughs> sure. How's everybody doing on this Saturday evening? <laughs> I'm like scared to touch my computer m uh, m moments before we did this. My computer kept turning off. I don't want to jinx myself though, knock on wood. So, um, hopefully Facebook will uh, stay going. What's up next? Mm. Under Cherry Boy? Yeah. Alright, we're going to play a new song. Um, we didn't play it last night. Some of your songs? Uh, okay. Um, cool, we're gonna play a couple August West tunes now. <laughs> it's not on there. Trigger Shane was the killer. Big star T for the win. Hey, signature shirt. Yeah. You should see his Animal Crossing. 
interesting character. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, yeah. Looks exactly like him. Uh, which one do you want to do first?
quarantined together, um, which makes music fun for me. <laughs> well, because I don't have to be it's all alone. Fun. Yeah, it makes music's already fun. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's what I meant. What did I say? It makes music fun. It makes quarantine fun for me. Um, yeah, it's weird times, so, you know, I'm feeling a, a little nutso, too, but, um, it's great. We're all, we're all in it together. It's great. It's great. <laughs> so, what do you want, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? Um, should we do Prime? Yeah. 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 So, um, as some of you probably already know, John Prine has coronavirus and he's in the hospital right now. Um, so we're all, you know, yeah, uh, sending all our energy out towards him. We can, um, yeah, and we, all love, John Prine. we love him. And um, we're gonna play a little song for you. <laughs> um, <laughs> And this oh, yeah. is, uh, this is kind of how we've been spending our days. Just learn a new song. Um, kind of the song explains how we've been spending our days. Oh, alright, I got you. Yeah. Is that so? It is so. Yeah. 
yeah, keep John Prine in your thoughts. Thanks so much. How's everyone doing on there? Looks like we're all, uh, we're all doing all right. All right. Hmm. Can't find a emoji. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Issue of the ages. What time is it, by the way? Mm hmm. Uh, 7.07. Okay. Okay. So, we'll play some more songs. What do you want to play? Should we? Do you want to do Line of Bengal yet, or do you want to do one more song, and then? What else do we have? Then you got plenty. <laughs> do you want to do like a little question, a little round of questions? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you want to? I mean, you don't. No, you, you tell me. Uh, yeah, get out there. Does anyone have any questions for us? Um. Oh yeah. 
Yeah. And it's not even a guilty pleasure. Pleasure. I love her. I think she's great. Um, follow her on Instagram. She's funny as hell, too. I ever played at was um, the Bug Jar in Rochester, but nice. after like a house party, the first like that was show. The first one I played the music with, yeah. Right, I played before you were in the band in Bug Jar. So. <laughs> I thought you were like, yeah, I was there. <laughs> um, but before that, I I would play at um, house shows. Uh, New York State Fair was about my first game. yeah. <laughs> These guys had been playing uh, in the family band when they were kids with their parents. That's right. That's right. I'm gone. Yeah. 
y'all. Nice. Um, thanks for tuning in. Um, maybe tuning in again if you uh, listened to us last night. Um, Which one of y'all shamed? <laughs> Who said that? Yeah. Oh, nice. That was back. <laughs> Um, and thank you so much um, to Adam for having us and Zoe for helping put this together uh, on Underwater Sunshine Fest page again. We love playing Underwater Sunshine Fest. We've played it twice now, and uh, hopefully we'll, we'll keep playing it. It's very special. Tunes. We'll get back to you. How do you fit a heart and a double bass? I've never done that. Just the heart, right? Yeah. yeah, so when we tour, Shane doesn't play upright. These, um, these streaming shows are actually the first shows that upright. Yeah, so this is it's super fun. It's a totally new formation for us. Um, just like working with what we got, and then he's playing mandolin, too. Harp wise, when we tour full band, I have a trailer for my harp, and then um, this harp goes in like a humongous wooden coffin case. It's really gnarly, <laughs> and it takes up like half the trailer. Not the heavy metal brand coffin case, but <laughs> no, like an actual coffin looking. A it's a body. <laughs> you could fit like three. Bodies <laughs> Trust me. Trust me, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Alright. Well, is this it? One, two more. I think we'll do maybe two more. Yeah, do Alright. Oh, I'm just singing, right? What key, what key is in it? Is it that?
think we're gonna play one more song. <clears throat> so that song is called. It's called Lion of Bengal. Oh, that song's called Lion of Bengal. Yeah. There you go. Um, what should we play? Like Home in the Country, maybe. Should we ask else? the audience? What does the audience want? You can pick from a select few songs <laughs> that if we don't know, we would play. <laughs> <laughs> um, how I mean, heck yeah. Um, we have a bell back there. That's musical. Um, This is another uh, Kean song, another August West tune that uh, Michaela Davis and myself have adapted. <laughs> semi-grand is really tight up at the top so um, they stopped making this model. So it's kind of cool I have this model, the Lion Healy, Lion and Healy Style 100 semi-grand, but um, my dream harp is called a Salcedo Harp Lion and Healy. Check it out, it's very like art deco and uh, but this, very uh, cool. This harp allows you to do straight Right, but because it's so tight up up at the top, you can't see because you're kind of far away, but um, up here, I, it makes me be able to pitch bend much lower than a normal harp can. That's about as low. You get so, a whole step out of it. Does it make your harp go out of tune? Probably, yeah. <laughs> but the other problem is I haven't regulated my harp in like just years. Destroying your harp every time you do it. Yeah. Um, not destroying it, but <clears throat> it definitely like stretches the string out, so it'll make it. Go a little out of tune, go a little flat for sure. Um, but yeah, check out our uh, video we posted last week, Inner Light. Um, and I do a lot of pitch bending in that song. It's very, it's very fun to play on harp. Um, so there's your harp lesson for the day. And here's our last song. Thanks so much. One, two.
Concerts, whereas you know, 100 years ago, when they're in quarantine, they couldn't do this sort of thing. So, um, yeah, yeah. It so, social media is it can be good. Can be good. <laughs> anyway, goodbye. Anyway, Thank you so much for listening. We're so happy you guys were listening. Um, it's been a great day, and bye. Yeah,